Well, good morning. We are uh, up and about already. It's about 7.30 in the morning. Let's go get some coffee and uh, get ready to get this day started. But uh, I want to show our condo tower that we've been staying at. That's our Airbnb up there. We are up on the 11th floor and our room actually faces the other side, the back side of this building. And there's actually two towers to this complex. This is a Vita Tower number one, and that is a Vita Tower number two. And right in the middle, right in here, that's a pool that uh, both towers share. And like I said, we're on the opposite side facing the other direction. And uh, again, we're here at IT Park. And this is the Mercado District, which is basically just a giant little block area of local merchants selling various types of food and drink and dessert things of that nature actually my dad said i was born in this area you was born in mccardo uh, no oh before this was developed. they had a birthing station there no. before <laughs> this area was developed formerly oh. um around here are just trees and there's nothing so anyway we're going to make our way to our to a coffee shop that Mia knows about over here. All right, you lead the way. I follow you. At nighttime, especially on the weekends, this place is packed with people, especially there in the Mercado. Over here. That bar. That time. That yeah. Bar. Yeah, they got tons of pool tables over there. And there's just all kinds of different restaurants around here to eat at. And like I said, it's really packed on the weekends. Everybody coming out here and socializing and getting their groove on, getting their eat on, just enjoying life. But anyway, let's head to that coffee shop, baby. Well, our breakfast is out and I actually only ordered the muffin, but I think she misunderstood and gave me a sandwich as well. But uh, we've got a couple of breakfast sandwiches, muffin, and our coffees. What do you think about that? Oh, that's a good my coffee. Mia's ready for her coffee, she says. Since we got here, we, I've been drinking um, three-in-one coffee, not a coffee. A three-in-one coffee is not bad. I kind of like it. Anyway, we're supposed to get down on this here breakfast. Me is starving. We are back at the Mercado. It's like one of the first places we came last year, right? It's like a central part of the uh, uh, IT park. Where they've got all these different merchants that sell just tons of variety of food. One big square. Just walk around in the central park is right there where they sit down and eat the foods that they buy and I just missed it but they was just torching that piece of meat right there with like a flamethrower. Uh, you gonna give me some mango. Oh mango? You like mango juice? Yeah. Uh-huh. I wanna see how they do it. Okay, it's a shake, it's a mango shake and they put mango toppings with ice cream on it. Is that what you want? I'm gonna get it later. Oh, later? Okay. We'll keep walking around for right now, see what else they got. Uh -huh. I think this is the one. This is the one I recommend you. You try it? Wow. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna get crazy. Uh, liver? Huh? Liver? Uh, well, liver is not a big deal. I can eat liver. Pork liver. 
Oh, oh pork. Oh man, what she got there? Oh, she got some sauce on hers. I want some. Want... Okay, let's let's walk on down because I need to find that one place that, that has the. Uh... What do we got here? Oh, sea sig. Sea sig bar. All right, here goes me loading up my uh, my dinner for the night. What do we got here? Oh, what? We call it isao. It's a chicken intestine. Yikes. Okay, what's well, already in the basket there? And it's a chicken liver. Uh, I can deal with the liver. That ain't no problem. Alright. This is just pork skewers. Yeah, like what kind of what you make? This is a uh, very popular meal. It's a chorizo. Chorizo sausage. I like sausage. All right. That's good enough? Yeah, that's good enough. Okay. Yeah. Do you want Huh? No, 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 no rice. Just that sauce. Put that sauce on it. We'll see. We'll see what it looks like here in a second if they grill it up. Well, we actually found us a seat here at the Mercado. We had to wait for somebody to leave. We kind of eyeballed them and stood over them while they just finished up the last part of their meal. So we, they take a hint and leave. There's so much smoke in here. Oh my God, it's worse. We're getting smoked out, but we got us a seat. Good Lord, we're getting smoked out. Look at that, smoke. Me is slurping down her mango shake. It's a very good mango shake for her. For two dollars. Two dollars, man. At home, ninety-nine, ninety-nine peso. peso. It's about two dollars. Yeah, yeah, I mean they got like huge chunks. Of, show the bottom of that cup, all the chunks it's of mango. Got a mango shake and a lot of chunks of mango. Very sweet mango and ice cream. Mango ice cream. Big old cup too. They filled it up too. Yes. Yeah, so if you hit up Subway, ninety-nine pesos, you know, two dollars. Shit, at home that probably costs about five bucks. Smoothie factory, that'd be about seven dollars. Yeah, try, try May's mango shake real quick while she ain't looking. Yeah. Yeah, it is good. And it's already melted. I can imagine what it tastes like when it's fresh. But look at those chunks of mango in there. And it's got a huge straw. Look. Philippines is really big on uh, getting rid of the plastic straws, so they got I am plastic free on the straw. And it's so like big around. I mean, every time you take a slurp of it, you get a big old hunk of mango. It's really, really good. It'd be worth five bucks at home. She needs to come on my food because I'm hungry. So Mr. Armstrong's trying to eat the Isao. I'm going to go with this one first because it's probably going to be the worst one. Get it out of the way. Let me see, let me see. Hey, what's this sauce right here? Oh, it's a, it's um. Do I dip it in there? Yes, do you want to put a pepper on it? Well, I'll probably just spicy. eat it by itself. It's a soy sauce and a vinegar. Okay, here we go. Uh, just bite a little bit first, to try it. It's not chewing at all. It looks like something. It looks like guts. <laughs> Very good, yeah. It's not a, not really a, a lot of taste to it at all, really. Oh. Oh, that was a big piece. I may regret that. Try the other one if you don't want to finish it. No? No. Try not to look at it. But it actually, it's not chewy. You wouldn't know it. And it was, you know, the intestines. Unless you really look at it. But as far as the taste, it's like meat. It's not chewy, it's not grisly. The texture is like meat. I don't have a problem with this at all. You wanna get down with this, really? Just two pieces? Oh, well, I don't know what happened. So, the one cooking it ate the other piece. <laughs> Probably fell in the fire. You gotta tell what is that. 
Oh, it's just a pork meat, right? Yeah, it's just like a pork skewer that I always cook for you. Again, guys, yeah, you cook this at home, so. There's no worries on this at all. It tastes like pork meat. Really good. Oh, you didn't use your gloves, huh? Real good pork barbecue. It's sliced really, really thin, so it, it got a little tough. But it tastes good. The taste was real good. People like it tough. It was a nice one. Huh? You promised me this is liver. It is chicken liver. I'm trying. I ain't chicken liver at home. It has a heart on it on the top. There you go. Wow. Usually chicken liver at home is like a... Almost like it got breading on it. This one don't, it's just barbecue. And it tastes like liver. I'll eat liver at home every once in a while. And that does me for a while. So, and that does me for right now. Okay. Now we're going for the longanista. Not longanista. Chorizo. Whew. Hot. Fresh off the grill, so it's really hot. But man, is that good. I'm talking about. I don't know if this is. Was it pork? Pork, sausage, chorizo. I'll tell you right now, this is good. I can remember eating this at uh, Rice and Blue on my first trip here to Cebu. And I tore this stuff up. Watch out for the string. Don't eat the string. Oh. You see this? You taste the string? Hot. That's fresh off the grill. It was hot. Had the uh, chicken isau, which is intestine. Isau. Isau, I'm sorry. The really thin sliced pork meat, which is really good. Chicken liver, which is liver. <laughs> I mean, you can't say it's good, you can't say it's really bad. I've never really had a barbecue like this before. Not quite as done as I normally like, like to have it. But, and I'll finish it probably. But this longanista, I'll save it for last because it is delicious. Huh? It's chorizo. I'm sorry, I keep saying longanista. Longanista is like the sausage like link. This is a chorizo. But yeah, it's really, really good. So anyway. A little variety of local uh, barbecues from uh, Cebu. Just a little warm up <laughs> before I get to the uh, main event at a later time. Which I'll announce at a later time. <laughs> Alright, we'll face this and we'll go see what else we can find. Two on the sides. Okay, let me go. Oh, okay, let me go. Salamat. Mr. Armstrong, first time to get a haircut in the Philippines. Yeah, they'll lose, um, cut the power off at 10 o'clock. We might have an interruption. The power entire here. They were informed. Yeah. Because we were burn out, sir. We have burn out 10 p.m. You close 10 p.m. Yeah. They will lose power. They cut the power off. We have no um, electricity before 10 p.m. Yeah. Before yeah, 10. We were sorry. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay.